Praise the Lord Church. Today's Bible meditation is taken from Deuteronomy chapters 10, 11, Proverbs chapter 9, John chapter 12. If you're new to Living God family, a very warm welcome to you in Jesus' name. Hope this video will be a blessing to you as you hear and listen to the thoughts as we read through the Bible together. I encourage you to read the chapters during your personal devotion time and become recipients of listening to God's voice daily. Deuteronomy chapter 10 verses 20, 21 and 22. Fear the Lord your God and serve him. Hold fast to him and take your oaths in his name. He is the one you praise. He is your God who performed for you those great and awesome wonders you saw with your own eyes. Your ancestors who went down into Egypt were 70 in all. And now the Lord your God has made you as numerous as the stars in the sky. Deuteronomy chapter 11 verses 18 and 19. Fix these words of mine in your hearts and minds. Tie them as symbols on your hands and bind them on your foreheads. Teach them to your children, talking about them when you sit at home and when you walk along the road, when you lie down, when you get up. Proverbs chapter 9 verse 10. The fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom and knowledge of the Holy One is understanding. John chapter 12 verse 32. And I, when I am lifted up from the earth, will draw all people to myself. God the Almighty, our Heavenly Father, always keeps his word. God told Abraham his descendants will be as numerous as stars in the sky and promise he made was fulfilled. Today Jesus spoke the word that through his death on the cross, he will draw all people to himself and will give us life eternal. And it is coming to fulfillment. Let's heed to his gentle whispers and surrender our hearts and lives to him and walk in faith and belief to live with him for eternity. Thanks be to God for the gift of salvation. Praise be to our wonder-working God. In Jesus' name, Amen. Thank you for the privilege of your time in watching the videos and being part of Living God community. God bless you all abundantly as we are all created to be holy and happy in Christ Jesus. Amen.